Okay, milk. What's this one? Blah, blah, blah. And the cinnamon. Oh, you know what they're making? Oh, they sure are. Oh, my goodness. I love this, what they're making. But I usually just use eggs and milk, and that's it. And maybe some cinnamon. Okay. <coughs> what was that? Is that the oil popping? Vegetable oil, I usually use that. I can't afford that uh, uh, extra virgin olive oil. It's too much. We're mixing them, blah, 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 blah. Hot, begin to blah, 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 then start cooking. Okay, let's get some bread in there now. Well, Texas toast would be really better. Oh, don't get bread with, oh, that's kind of a weird kind of bread. It's got all them dots in there. That means it's like, uh, I don't know. I wouldn't eat. I like wheat bread, but I don't like all wheat kind of wheat bread that has uh, stuff in it. I just like plain old wheat bread. But I really would do Texas toast. That's a little bit better. Okay, flip it over, yeah. Make sure it's done in the middle, because I've done that before. I even tried cooking, cooking it in the oven. It don't work in the oven, believe me. <laughs> it really don't. I messed it up so bad in the oven. Anyway. Okay, a little more butter and oil between each slice. Another touch, uh, no gloves, that way you, you know, you'd be scratching your butt and you just grab a piece of bread, don't want it to come over your house, I tell you. Anyway, it's very easy, a great topping for French toast is sir. No, yeah, I'm not going to say that. No, I mean, no, yeah, we know, okay.